Hey, what's up guys? Lucas Gonzalez here. Uh, welcome to my first model review on my channel after I pointed out that I was going to do model reviews on my channel after the New Zealand flyout video. And we're gonna kick things off with a bang. Today I will be viewing the United Airlines 737-800 by in-flight 200 and a 1-200 scale. This is in the new livery known as the Evo Blue livery. And please stay tuned for future reviews as there is lots of reviews coming your way. This is one of 18 United models that I have in my collection. And this is probably my fourth 737 model. This is one of four 737 models I have, if I'm not mistaken. Um, some information about United Airlines. They are the world's largest airline by a number of destinations served. They're their operations base is at Willis Tower in Chicago. Their main hub is at Chicago O'Hare International Airport. Secondary hubs are Antonio B1 Penn International Airport, which is in Guam, Denver International Airport, George Bush Intercontinental, Honolulu International Airport, Los Angeles International Airport, Tokyo Narita International Airport, Newark Liberty International Airport, San Francisco International Airport, and Washington Dulles International Airport. They were founded on the 6th of April, 1926 in Boise, Idaho as Vining Airlines. Their fleet consists of 891 operating aircraft as of February, 2023. 141 of those are 737-800s. 12 of those are the regular 900s. 136 are 900 ERs. And 40 of those are 737-700s. So let's take a look at the box. Unfortunately, there are no sides on the box, some nice, there's a nice back with in-flight 200 as a, as a QR scanner, as well as the item number. There's a nice front as well. And this also slides off very easily, so. Some nice protection as well. We got the stand, which I'll get to later. And there's the model. All right, guys, the model is now out of the box and we're gonna start here at the port side at the cockpit windows. Hopefully it focuses correctly. And I'm also doing this in the, with an open window as well because it's really nice outside and I kind of like it with in the sun as well. We got carpet windows, window wipers, Peter Chief Setti ports, Star Alliance logo. As you know, United is a member of Star Alliance, which is a group of 26 airlines. And there's also some text as well underneath the Star Alliance logo. It's kind of hard to tell, and I honestly can't read it because it's hard for me to see as well. And there's also on the gear, there's 0267, which is their fleet number, and it says ETOPS. Got the United title. And we also got the, underneath the fuselage, we got the landing light. And then we have the really nice looking, we have a really nice engine. This is a CFMI CFM 56-7B26. Let's see if they spin. There's also some really nice looking details in the, so they don't seem to spin. Yeah, they don't seem to spin. That's okay. The details do look really nice inside the engine as well. There's the split scimitar winglet and also the red navigation light. We have the registration number, November 37267. And according to this registration number, this particular 737 was the first one to be painted in the United um, Evo Blue livery. Since this particular aircraft was shown in, in, I think it was a type of show in Chicago. And there's the really nice United logo on the tail. Let's now switch to the other side of the aircraft. 
Like once again, carpet windows, window wipers, PR chip set port, saw lines logo. We also got the fleet number 0267. And we also have E tops as well. Something on the cabin as well. United titles, inboard landing light. We got the engine. Got the split scimitar winglets and also the green navigation light. It's starting not to focus. That's okay. You can you can still see the green navigation light. We also got the one of the cargo doors underneath the fuselage. We got the registration number November three seven two six seven. We also got and we got the United logo on the tail as well. All right, time to discuss the seat map of this 737. We're going to review the seat map for this aircraft. So rows one through four is United First Class, which is from rows one to here. That is United's First Class. They are arranged in a 2-2 configuration. And rows seven through 21, which is right by the which ends right by the second exit door. I'm trying to get it right. I'm guessing it goes from here to here. That is Economy Plus seats. It, it is arranged in a 3 3 configuration. And rows 22 through 38, we have Economy Class, which is right behind the exit door. And it goes all the way to the back of the aircraft. That is economy plus. So now let's take a look at the let's take a look at the stand. It's a really nice looking, it's a metallic stand. I really like the way InFlight 200 makes their stands for their models. And there we go. So that's going to pretty much wrap it up for this review of my first ever model review. This is a United 737-800 in the Evo Blue livery by InFlight 200 in a 1-200 scale. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this review as much as I did. Feel free to leave a like and subscribe and feel free to stay tuned for more aviation content. As I'm planning to make a couple more Infinite Flight videos before I head off to Disney in a couple of days. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Lucas Gonzalez, and I will see you next time.